So I'm here with you, Mark, downtown condo specialist. Me and you have known each other for decades. 20 years almost. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And so, you know, speaking of 20 years, I remember this, Horton Plaza, what's happening with it? I remember in the 80s, this brought everybody here, right. and now it's, it's all closed down, Mark. It's all closed down, but you'll be surprised what it's going to turn into. A bunch yeah. of work, shared work office spaces. Mm -hmm. They're going to build a couple office towers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when this place comes back alive, it'll have about 4,000 jobs here. Wow. And 4,000 jobs means a lot of condo buyers in A downtown. lot of condo buyers, because those people don't want to drive back to the suburbs to go home. Absolutely not. So that's no. a huge demand spike for downtown property. Yeah. So. You know, it breaks my heart to see this. I have so many memories growing up here when I was in high school. Coming down to right. Horton Plaza was really a thing. Right. Now, it's going to be, it's going to shine and be beautiful again, but downtown's seen a little bit of growing pains right now, right? We're kind of stacking right. up our yeah. inventory. We have a lot of projects in the works, yeah. but none, nothing is finished right now. Right. Seaport Village is going to be redone. That's a $1.6 billion transformation. $1.6 bill, and it's going to go higher density, right? Higher density, a lot more shops. Going yeah. to put a, a space needle of sorts there they call a spire. Awesome, and not just tourist stuff. It'll be for, for us the, to the go locals, and enjoy. Exactly, yeah. yeah. It's a big difference than the way it operates right I now. I like it. UCSD is also opening a campus downtown. Amazing. Which always grows and grows. Right. And good college like that. Right. So there's going to be more and more people coming into downtown. And on the real estate sense, all the good property has already been bought up. Yeah. There's not a whole lot of good property left to build on. Yeah, so there's about 10,500 condos that people own individually. In downtown, right? Right, in the downtown zip code. Right. And so we think with 4,000 jobs, we'll probably get another 1,000 buyers. So right. on the horizon, even though this is old, we got some really new stuff we're going to look at next, right? We're going to go look at the brand new building that just opened up last month in downtown called Savina awesome. by Bosa in Little Italy. It's very sexy, high demand. A lot of people are selling the old condos downtown to trade up to the new stuff. You'll love it once we get there. Awesome. Can't wait to see it. This lobby is incredible. Welcome to Savina. Wait till you see the amenities. Awesome. Mark, that lobby is incredible. Oh, well, it's huge. Yeah, yeah, yeah the yeah. concierge there. And now right. we're at the amenities, and yeah. like, this is great with the pool over right, there, right, yeah. the social lounge. Yeah, I mean, Bose has dedicated more amenity space in this building than any other building downtown, yeah. 24,000 square feet. So a lot of people are buying in here for the lifestyle that you get with the building, not only in the unit, which yeah. is nice and modern, sexy finishes, yeah, but also the amenity space here that you can kind of feel like you're kind of on a cruise ship, even though you're still in the condo building. You do, building. and yeah. you can see the bay and the cruise ship here Right. And it's just incredible. Yeah. Take a walk. Right. Even if your unit doesn't have a bay view, you can come down here on the fifth floor and you have a nice bay view. What are you seeing on buyers' expectations on this luxury area, like in the common areas and right. in the amenities? Yeah. Well, the buyers are demanding more and more amenities nowadays. And this yeah. building has more than in any other building downtown. Right behind us, it's a pet retreat. Uh, you can see you can come in here and play shuffleboard, play pool, big screen TV, and you can use this 24-7. You don't yeah. have to reserve it if you don't want to. Right, the but outdoor space The outdoor too space is, is phenomenal. You have a bay view from anywhere in the amenities yeah. space. Skylights, Skylights, bright open. All of my buyers and your buyers, they always ask us about the HOAs. And when right, they right. first see it downtown, they're stunned. Right. Then they see what they get yeah, yeah, and yeah. what they save on other stuff and they go for it, right? I've had buyers tell me specifically, the HOA seems kind of high. They move into the building, I run into them three months later. I can't believe they do all that for so little money every Is month. Is that incredible? That's what they tell me. I've heard that story too. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So you really get the bang for your buck because yeah. you have 280 people contributing mm -hmm. to the HOA, so it's a very efficient spend of the money. This is an exciting time, Mark. This place is amazing. Yeah. Thanks for having me out. I My really pleasure, appreciate George. it. My pleasure, George. Yeah, good seeing you. You too.